on y'all I just wanted to show y'all mixer that I'm working with this Behringer um, Zen Xenix XENYX502 mixer one two three four five five inputs to this uh, mixer right here quarter inch quarter inch line in it's got trim extra gain EQ high EQ low EQ pan left and right a clip meter potential meter volume meter over here it's got line one and line two and oops take that back let me see line three four and four and five that is because this was line one so anyway there's four inputs here where you can run mono if you wanted to if you wanted to you can run straight mono or you can just run left and right for left and right stereo when you run it left and right hey you can you can pan it any way you really wanted to okay um the balance there's a balance on it but the deal of it is is that if you want it you can either pan it to the left for two and pan it to the left for three but if you want to keep them both in the middle just keep just keep it right in the middle um got two outputs the outputs are quarter inch out but you can run quarter inch out and you can change it over to whatever you want it to you can you know you can change it over to a quarter inch out to RCA or just quarter inch out. And quarter inch out is meaning that it has these. But with these, sometimes you have to make sure that it's, uh, even though it's a tip and ring, make sure sometimes you have to watch out whether to see whether or not it's stereo or is it mono. You know, um, with this mixer here, also. It has the inputs, RCA input. Great mixing tool. You know, you actually could run a DJ system. If I was running DJ system the way I used to run it a long time ago, I would run my whole mixer straight into this input right here. Just into this input right here and keep it going. And there's the output. There's an output right there. So you can record the whole thing while you're doing it too. You can, you can go RC out. RC out to uh, RC out to one eighth. That's that little small hole into a computer. Let me see. Like this, one eighth to RCA. However, you want to do it. Uh, headphone jack. It's excellent. It's great for mixing. And I'll be mixing some of everything with it. But I just thought that I would just show that, share that with you. Because it has helped me out so much. Now I got this 16 track here. The 16 track, it has extra auxiliaries. And um, it's a four bus, four bus mixer. And I don't want to get too complicated and get too deep off into that. But when you move on up in the mixers, then you start getting off into this right here. But these right here, they still are very useful. Yes. But anyway, y'all, I just thought I'd share that for today. Peace until the next time.